Welcome back to Triple R. We have Grave Diggers, a game by Twilight Creations. So I played this once. It was okay. Uh, it's like a blind bidding game. So you have your screens to keep things hidden. And these cards are going to manipulate what happens when you do the reveals. Two to five players, 30 minutes. So there's a lot of like picking up stuff in the middle and rearranging it. Like it's a little tedious. It's not horrible. We'll go through the instructions, they're pretty light. So, Grave Diggers by Reiner Kinzias. So, it gives you a little backstory two to five special cards. And I'll try to hold this here so you can pause it and read the instructions in case you have it and lost the game or lost the instructions. Does the game end? Terry robbery. Cards and card values. What each one does. Grieving video. Grieving video. Grieving widow. Guard. Bandits. And your note. All right. So let's take a look at some of the components. Which are pretty decent. Get the cards here. Then your grid. So these are gonna make up the graveyard. So they're gonna say different things, like a place. So you place someone at a different um, area, reveal, you, so on and so on. And they'll go down like this. So not too many, so it goes kind of fast. And here's your board to keep things secret. They're all the same, just different colors. But they're nice, they're well made. And you have a cheat sheet for your card effects, what things do. Well, that's nice. So you'll keep your, your bid hidden under there. Um, tokens are here. So you have fives and ones, and a minus 10. So, or 20. So different variations, which you're going to bid with. Which you're trying to score the most points, rob the most graves, or rob the most wealth out of the grave, I guess. And these cards will be doing different things. You'll play some and will do a different effect. So here's this money. It's going to be underneath. This X, I think, doubles the money. So if you have this, it'll be five times two. So this doubles, so that'd be 10. So it's a nice, decent art. Money on there, you got the gold bar, you got the widow, green widow, accomplice. Like I said, and the cheat sheet tells you what they do, the bandit. So a couple specials and then the money cards and your guard here. So I played okay. It wasn't a bad game. Um, blind bidding is kind of, you know, luck involved. Because it's blind bidding. But the worst little thing. So it was worth what I paid for it to play the one game. Like I said, I'm probably not going to play again. It was $3.50 for me. I don't know what it retails for, but I like I had to give away pile as well. Just because I'm trying to downsize. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night. Wherever you are.